We live in stressful times, and that has led some folks to come up with a very creative way to get the TLC they're looking for. CBS News national correspondent Dean Reynolds has the story. Welcome to Cuddle Party, everyone. They had all arrived at this quiet address on Chicago's north side intent on cuddling. My name is Will and I am your cuddle party lifeguard. On cuddle here. expert Will McKay and his trusty lieutenant Madeline Guinazzo read the rules of the road or mattress in this case. You must get verbal permission before you touch anyone. Sanctioned cuddle parties like this one have been going on for about five years with pajama clad strangers hugging stroking, spooning, and massaging to their heart's content. Oh, God, that's good. In case you're wondering, cuddle parties are strictly non-sexual. The 11 participants here today were made aware of that in no uncertain terms. Co-founders Marsha Bazinski and Reed Mahalko created the events to help people rediscover touch and affection. But nobody has to touch anybody if they don't want to. It's just great to have a place where I can get comfortable saying no. Can I touch your forehead too? Yes. Okay. Kristen Gravatt is an FTC, or first time cuddler. I didn't think it was gonna be weird or creepy per se. I just didn't know how I was going to respond. So is all this touching good for you? Touching as an adult is really important because it keeps us connected to others, keeps our emotions high, and keeps us feeling good. Yeah, I like that. It's hard to say whether cuddle parties are a phenomenon just waiting to sweep the nation. <sighs> but in these difficult, stressed out days, who wouldn't want a hug? <laughs> Dean Reynolds, CBS News, Chicago. Thank you. <laughs> okay, ad ad additional cuddle um, party factoids, please. if you will. Yeah, please. Thirty dollars to attend. Mm -hmm. Three or thirty. Thirty, yeah, three zero. Mm -hmm. Before you start cuddling, you have to establish what's called "quote unquote" your cuddle boundaries. Mm -hmm. And finally, at the end of the party, everyone uh, participates in what they call a puppy pile, which I think we're about to see, where they literally just kind of pile on top of each other on on the floor. All right. So any right, any takers? Well, well, no, because here's what I, I got this email, and I thought that you were inviting us all over <laughs> to... <laughs> Cuddle my womb? Yes. <laughs> no. Let no? me tell you, I love you all very much, but I would never yeah. do that with you, ever. Yeah. Really? I'm not evolved enough, if, the, if you got a puppy out of the puppy pile, then I would do that. Yeah. Oh. Is, is there ever a buffet? At the cuddle <laughs> that, that could something make a worthwhile. Right? I'll cuddle the buffet. <laughs> yeah. I do like some of the expanded rules, though. One of them, I think, is if you think it's a maybe, that's a no. Yeah. In yeah. other words, you Good shouldn't. Guy. Right? Okay. I only go to parties when there's going to be cheese. <laughs> <laughs>